Hey guys, what's up? My name is the Santiago Gamer. Welcome back to another video. Today I'll be doing a top five Call of Duty video. Today I'll be doing the top five worst BO3 guns in Call of Duty Zombies BO3, of course. And this I'll be judging it without double tap because there are some guns you use with double tap and it's good. But you know, we're not counting double tap. So let's get right into this list with number five. Number five, we're gonna have the Shiva. Shiva, I thought this would be like the MK14, but really isn't. Like, I don't really like this gun. Like, I thought I'd get rid of it round. I have to get rid of it round four. Like the MK, I I can keep it into like round, you know, six, seven, maybe eight. This gun just not it, and it takes a like it's good with headshots. I'd say that, but it's a starting room challenge. It's a starting room gun, so I'm gonna give it that. So, he, that's at number 5, but uh, keeping it low because it's only a spawn room gun. Coming down to our number 4 spot will be the XM53, and now I'm being easy on this. This could be higher on the list, but you know, it's a rocket launcher, so I'm going to give it some, you know, give it a little bit of light, but we've seen good. Really good rocket launchers, RPG, the law. This ain't this ain't it. This, this ain't a good one. Um, where do I start? The ammo, it's, uh, it's okay, but it's an explosive, so it doesn't have that much ammo, of course. So it's not as good as the RPG or the law. I've, it's just not as good, but you know, I'm gonna really give it some. Coming down to our number three spot, sorry for that cut in number four, will be the Elkar 9. And this gun, ooh, it's, it's an automatic pistol. Let's get that in, out of the way. It's an automatic pistol. So that means you're gonna run out of ammo pretty fast. It's good with headshots, but then when you get to the bodies, ugh, it's just disgusting there. So, yeah, it, so it runs out of ammo pretty fast, but. It's, you know, I, I can deal with it, you know, early rounds is good, but when you get into later rounds, this this ain't an option, of course, but, you know, I think the only problem... Coming down to the number two spot, again, sorry for the cut, is the Pharaoh, and you guys, some of you guys might be surprised. Pharaoh, I don't think it's the worst gun, it's just, I think it's the second worst, but this gun, look at this, I'm getting, trying to get headshots, it takes like two burst headshots trying to get him down. Like, it's good in multiplayer, but not, just, no, not in zombies. Uh, this, this ain't a viable option. Why would you take this? It's not, it's probably good for points, and that's about it. I have to waste a monkey here, so I don't die. So, yep, that's my number two spot. I don't want to get cut off like the last two, so, number two, this is number two. And our number one spot is the Gorgon. Oh my god, I hate this gun. It's an LM, you might see double tap. This thing sucks with double tap. That's how bad it is. And it's an LMG. And most of the LMGs are good. Not this one. Not this one. Just no. See, I'm using double tap. I have to shoot a couple of shots into their head. So, and, and it's an LMG. So if you have no sleight of hand, you are screwed. So I'm trying to get out of here. Then I'm like, I'm screwed. I have to pull out my ray gun. My ray gun can't even save me. That's how bad the Gorgon is. Oh my god. I think that's the worst of all of Call of Duty Black Ops 3 guns. I think that's the worst. Um, well, I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you like it, hit the like button in the face. I'm sorry, I just had to do that. But you know, if you liked it, and if you want to see more top fives, you know, subscribe. We're almost at 30. So, hope you guys enjoy the video. See you guys in the next one.